So I put that application down. We're gonna start seeing some clearing up in this in a couple of weeks. And then that's gonna be gone. Now I couldn't make a video to show you all a line that had a whole bunch of brown patch in it and then don't have a follow-up video showing you all the results, right? So do you all remember this line right here? This line right here was reeking with brown patch. It had brown patch everywhere, all around the tree. Brown patch was just having its way in this line, right? Well, we're back at this line a couple of weeks later and I'm going to show you what happened to that brown patch. But I can't leave here without putting some stripes down, right? So I'm gonna go ahead, put a cut on this line, and then we're gonna walk back over it and see if we can be able to still see any spots that may be lingering around. Let's see. So the line is cut and if you remember there were brown patch spots all over here in this area. There were brown patch spots all in this area. There were brown patch spots over here near this tree. I think that was one spot right there. But it has cleared up. Now this line here was really reeking with a lot of brown patch, but I used that ass prop that was two weeks ago. You seen what the brown patch looked like and you see what it looks like now. No more brown patch spots. They're all gone. Now, of course, I'm just referring to Asprop, but you also can use the ZZX and BioAdvance if you do have brown patch. Just remember that the ZZX is a granular, so you want to put that down, water it in, and then that has to dissolve and then get into the plant and they can be able to protect your line that way. The BioAdvance, that's a spray. You hook it up to your water hose, spray it all over your lawn. Those will take care of the brown patch as well. It just may take a little bit longer, but it will take care of the brown patch. But as far as this line, that ass prop, they knocked it straight out the box. Now you see this spot right here? This spot right here is heat stress. This is what a lot of people see, brown. Remember I told you how to identify heat stress. The grass is needled up, it's very thin, okay? Now, let's walk over here. A couple steps over. See this spot? It's brown, but it's not heat stress. You see that? That's a lesion. This is brown patch. So this spot right here is where the hot spot was. And no, the fungicide did not take care of the hot spot. We have been getting some rain and that's been filling in. So that's just to let you know that was two weeks ago that has filled in. Even though I just did a video showing you how if you water your hot spots aggressively, you can be able to get rid of those hot spots. But the hot spot was right here. And then remember the brown patch spot was over here somewhere. It was right over here right over here do you see it do you see it i can't see it i don't see it to be honest that's all i see is money green grass money green grass so i hope this video was helpful to you all remember 
If you're not comfortable with using ASPROP and mixing it, you can either call a specialist and get them to do it, or if you're just comfortable with just putting down Disease X and BioAdvance, you can do that as well. Either way, any one of them will work. But as far as this line right here, that ASPROP knocked it out, two weeks, brown patch, gone. So that about wraps this video up. I thank you all for tuning in. Y'all have a blessed one, and I'll see y'all in the next one. And keep that fungus out your line.